feel that wind on your skin? Tread soft, that's a monster nest, if ever I've seen one. All ashore that's going ashore. Such a dark night. Buffer than ever. Feels good.
sure is a shame when there's a forest fire. the chug yard. The right key could open this. That's not opening on its own. The board mainly has posts from those that used to work at the chug yard back in the days gone. They don't make much sense these days. Not much more to say about the board, but Gizmo is holed up in the underyard here working on that mecton of his. The Toxanol Corporation used to run chugger chuggers out of here, big machines on rails with smokestacks that fouled the air. They can carry you anywhere you like, well, anywhere that they go to, and then you can leg it from there. You're on the right track. Keep your eyes open. Light is the best, period. Tribes always scavenging for scrap, and the yard has plenty to go around. But they should have stuck to looting instead of playing around with sprockets. You're in pain. 
running low. Bomber Bonkers busy ram banging the door. This is your chance. Let's see. This box once tailed a chugger chugger. Now it's just off track. As long as karma exists, the world changes, and we change with it. Right where it cuts! Yes, you can do anything. The sky's the limit. Now. Let's take this back to Earth. Wow, you really took that all the way down to the end, in flames. It's a wonder some of these up and downs still work. Guess they built machines better in the past. Gross. This place stinks. The spent nuclear fuel that Toxanol dumped in the surf had detrimental effects on the marine habitats, while the overflowing landfills contaminated the groundwater. Combined, this sent their world hurtling on an inevitable road to ruin. The best stories are about heroes. This is such a story. I need to brush up on my Wando, but I have a feeling he believes it was you that caused the bang at the yard. Oh, and he says he knows you. You used to call him Gizmo. He gave you the oil-greased hands when he taught you how to upcycle. Gizmo remembers you as a nice kidling, and he can still sense the warmth of your good heart. But Gizmo says how you experience a memory can be different. You know the story, but sometimes the truth it brings is personal. It carries so much hate, 
and its insatiable hunger has only increased over the years since it claimed revenge on your parents. Gizmo says he also has re-memories from the long gone, but unlike you, he doesn't think of the past, for it's gone. He understands history made Loopa Loop in a big part of your past, your present, and soon, your future. You still believe there's some good in everyone. You still have hope for tomorrow. He says you should know that what's meant to be will always find a way, but history shouldn't consume you. Gizmo encourages that. You should forgive, but never forget. It'll provide some comfort to your soul and keep the memory of lost loved ones in your heart. Come toward the light. Slow down. Why would you rush in? When you see what you want, why wait? Well, what about being careful? Pah! Poppycock! Full speed ahead! Would like to know if you ever doubt the choices you made on the path that brought you to this point. Would you have been happier going in a different direction? Supposes that's all any of us can do. Sad to see the Tree of Life is going to die and take everything with it, but it's not like he didn't expect it. Grateful to you for coming back and doing your best to change things, you were the only chance they had. Wonders if you liked working with the Jagni. They always hunker down in their homes, gathering their things around them. Says home is a base, but it doesn't have to be everything. The world is wider than you know. But that's not important now. Gizmo says it's taken a long time to bring the past up to the present, and where you go from here is up to you. You need to set the past aside, at least for now. He can't leave the Underyard as he has no protection against the vacuum in the Dead Zone. So you need to salvage scrap to upcycle the Mecton, starting with the old crate outside. You should return when you've retrieved the scrap. There's no time to waste if you want to make the Mecton strong enough to fight the Jumbo Puff. It's the part of the land that suffered most from the apocalypse. It's deprived of oxygen, making it next to impossible for anything but creatures that were most contorted by the contamination.
They're short of breath and death to this zone. Better take care. He who half breathes, half lives. The world needs saving. Make the most of the day. That's the leftover you're looking for. They're short of breath and death to this zone. Better take care. He who half breathes, half lives. That's the leftover you're looking for. Keep your eyes out for new paths. Easy to miss things down here. 